Hi there. Um, we actually spoke before about your last film, so lovely to meet you again. Are you excited to be here tonight? Yes, I live locally. Uh, this is my local arts centre, if you like. Um, I've come here, I see concerts here all the time, and, and I know the courses for children are amazing. So it's, some, it, it's a, a very crucial centre for us in this part of London, so it's definitely worth supporting. That's why I'm here. And, and why do you think it's important to encourage a diversity of young people to get into the arts? Well, I think it's important because the arts represent who we are as a nation. You know, when we see arts, whether it's film, television, music, art, you know, that te that's a reflection, it's a mirror on who we are. So if certain voices aren't expressed there, then we get a very lopsided view, you know, of, of us. And so it's important that every voice is encouraged. And have you seen the UK arts industry change, thinking back to the days of Bend It Like Beckham, for example? I think there's a lot more uh, initiatives and a lot more interest in hearing varied voices. I think it's still a struggle for certain people to, you know, get out there and ha be heard. But I think there's certainly a lot more appetite to encourage uh, diversity, that's for sure. And what's been the reception to your film now it's been out? Fantastic. I'm very, very pleased. It's been very moving and touching for a lot of people. And the box office has been great. And... Um, but more than that, I think the amount of people who have written to me and talked to me after screenings and saying how moved they've been by the film, that's very gratifying because the great thing about film is it's there. It's there forever now. That history, that story is there forever. And I might move on, you know, but people will always be discovering it, you know, as they are Bend It Like Beckham, you know, a whole new generation is now discovering that film. And, 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 and what's next? What, what have you got coming up? Uh, next, well, the movie opens, Viceroy's House opens in Australia and India and around the world. So I'm on that, on that road show. <laughs> but there's projects I'm working on absolutely at the same time. Some interesting stuff, yeah. Fantastic. Well, enjoy the evening. I'm going to speak to you again. <laughs> Thanks.